to add a list to our website we're having to up to create unordered list and unordered list is the list with bullets or with dots or to create ordered list the one with um, list items one two three four and so on for the unordered list we're having an opening tag with ul and a closing tag with ul for the unordered list we're having ol as the open tag and slash ol as a closing tag for each item on the list we need to add li slash this is the opening one and the closing tag slash li we're going to edit the project we created for last week assignment i have it here on documents okay and a folder named it project one here we have the html file we need to open the html file uh, using notepad so select your file right click open with and select notepad okay uh, in between the body open and the body close and after the paragraph tag we're going to click enter and then type ul to create unordered list this is the open tag and we're having a closing tag with ul okay in between ul open and ul close we're gonna add list item number one this is the open list item and closed list item for list item number one we're gonna type studying for next week computer quiz okay and for list item number two li we're gonna make it submitting my homework and close the li to display the new changes on the website and file save Okay. here we have the heading and then the paragraph and then the unordered list with two list items we need to add a title for our list from here we can add a heading before the ul remember the heading has different sizes from one to six where one as the largest one and six as the smallest one open tag with h we're gonna make it four okay and close tag with h4 in between h4 open and h4 close we're gonna type my to do list to display the changes file save refresh now we're having a title for our list to change the list from being uh, unordered list to be ordered list to display the list uh, in one two three four we're going to change the ul to be ol okay and the ul close to be ol file save refresh now we're having ordered list with two to add an image to your website you need to use the following tag the img tag is different from the paragraph tag and the heading tag the starting tag is img and the closing tag is slash 
in between we're having src and src representing the source or the name of the image then we need to add an alternative name the alt okay the alternative name is a name will be displayed if there is anything wrong with the uploading of the image the name of the image is wrong has something uh, wrong uh, with the spelling and so on it will be displayed as we're having here an error and then the alternative name we wrote in the tag to add um, an image to our website we're going to download any image okay from google click here we're going to add um, a happy okay i have this image download any one okay this one is okay right click save image as okay and make sure that you're going to save the image inside the folder where you saved it your project okay the html file and the image should be placed it in the same folder from documents i'm going to select the folder of my project change its name to be happy for example and click save back to our folder now we're having the html file and the image in the same folder again to display the image correctly on the website both the file and the image should be placed it in the same folder back to the notepad after the ol close press enter then open tag i m g take a space s r c equal the name of the image should be displayed in between double quotations you can type the name happy okay dot j p g or from here you can right click rename and copy the name of the file and the type of the file after dot jpg as the type of the image you need to copy that all okay and place the name in between the double quotations now we need to add the alternative name or the alt okay again in between double quotation any alternative name we're gonna name it happy okay and then close slash close okay file save from here refresh now we're having the image displayed on the website well we're having an error with the name of the image for example i'm going to delete one of the p okay now the spelling of the image is wrong so from file save refresh now it will display an error and the alternative name of the app.